Hey, hello guys, it's me again, Maria, and today's tutorial, I will be showing you how you can create hundreds, thousands of dots to dots using your own image like what you see here. So I'm going to use my own image, my picture, and I'll show you guys how to do that using Canva. So without any further ado, let's do this. Alright, so now we are here in Canva homepage and we're going to create a dot to dot project. So, first you're gonna do is to uh, choose the template you want. So, here are the templates. So, just keep on, you know, uh, scrolling here and then choose the template that you just saw. Uh, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm gonna use the, the poster. Okay, so from here, you're gonna see there are a lot of icons here. Just click this one and then you're going to upload the uh, image that you already uploaded so if you're not uploaded in the image yet just go to here to upload media and it will take you to your files so where you can uh, upload the picture or images that you want so since i've already done that so i'm going to drag this picture over here and this is what i want to create my dot to dot if you prefer to use your image or pictures to create your dot to dot all right so now you see here and i think um i don't need the background you see there's a background so i'm going to remove the background so to remove the background you have to be in a pro member so if you're not a pro member of a canva you cannot use the tools of background remover but even though you're using the free account you can still create a project dot to dot tracing coloring things like that but if you want to try the 30 days trial for pro account i'm going to put the link on the description just click the link and feel free to use the 30 days trial so you can use other uh, tools that um, they offered for pro account to remove the background i'm going to remove it by clicking this edit image okay so click the edit image and then click the background remover take a few seconds and you will see there's no more background so i'm going to use this to create my dot to dots so now you see guys there's a space here i don't think that i need the space at the top so what i'm gonna do here is i'm going to crop this one click the crop and just you know crop this one so I can make a little bit bigger for my image okay so now once you crop it you can move this wherever you want you can resize it but make sure that you uh, make sure that you leave a space from the bottom to the top left and right because we're going to put the dots to that and at the same time we're going to put the numbers so you have a space for those uh, numbers and dots okay so now i'm gonna use this one and then we're going to start putting the dots okay so to do that how you get the dots you just scroll here at the bottom here and you see the more one if you see the more you can see the draw better so if you see the draw better here just click it but if you already see here on your uh left side of the icon there's a draw better here you don't need to do to go to more just click the draw better and it will give you this uh selection of brushes colors and more so i'm going to use the pen here and then here is the size where you know you what size of your dots you want to if you want a bigger bigger dots you can just move it here a little bit but for the sake of this tutorial, I might use like maybe 40 things like that so you can easily see. And you choose the color, you can choose the black, you know, you, there's so many colors here that you can choose from. So I'm going to use the black one for my dots. And then once you've done with that, then you can now start creating that. So you see this one, I'm going to make this a little bit bigger, zoom a little bit so you can see here that here is the black dot that you can start putting the dots on the picture my picture is so bright so i just make this a little bit transparent you know just move this a little bit here but do not make it zero okay just make it like maybe uh, 50 things like that okay so you have a guide and pattern to where you put your your dots and then later on once you've done doing your dots you can just you know uh 
put it to zero so what they can see is only the that they cannot see the images the pictures that you you put in here okay now so now let's go back to the pen and then i'm gonna make this 40 and then i'm gonna use the black one so you can see for my dots i use the black and then here you go so now you can start putting the dots wherever you want and it depends on how many dots that you want to use for your project if you want to use hundreds of dots thousands of dots tens twenties things like that it depends on your project or if you want to create a uh, activity for your kids you can create one to ten you know one to twenties things like that so keep doing this uh, creating that and then after that we can just uh, put the numbers on the side of the dots and as you see my I have a eyeglass here I can also uh, create more dots here in addition to my the number of dots that I want for this project okay I'm not gonna make a thousands of dots I'm just showing you guys that you can make as many as you want for your project so if you finish doing this one uh, you don't need the picture right so I'm gonna show you guys how it looks like once you've done with all of the dots uh, what you're gonna do here is just to click the done and then uh, you see there's the dots here and as you see I you, you don't want to use the image you want to you know the image to remove it after you finish your project okay to do that you're going back to the transparency here this is the you see there is a uh, two layers okay the the one is inside of this layer is the the dot for the dots and this one is for your pictures so you're gonna click that and go to transparency and then what you're gonna do is just to drag this to zero so that you they can see the image so you see once you finish your dots once you finish the the amount of dots that you want for your project what you're gonna do is to go back to the transparency and just drag this to zero so um what they're gonna do is just to you know connect the dots so after they finish connecting the dots then they will see the image that you put into your dots okay that's how you gonna do it at the end after you put all the numbers and all the dots for your project okay so now once you finish your dots and you already uh, make like thousands and hundreds of dots what you're gonna do is we're going to put the numbers so to do that you're going back to this side uh, here on the left side and you will see the text okay click the text and here let's uh, use this one and we're going to create numbers using this one okay so I'm gonna do this one and then here are the uh, fonts for your numbers or whatever number whatever fonts you want you can just um, choose the fonts you want here and let's say I choose this one and here is the uh, size of the font you can decrease it or increase it well it depends on the project how big is your project so if you have so many dots you might you might like to use uh, a little bit uh, smaller or decrease the size of the numbers so it won't you know um, hitting each other all right so now I'm going to just click one here and then as you see you can uh, put this number wherever you want to start your dots okay you can put this number one here on the top you can put number one here or here so wherever you want okay so like for example I'm going to put my number one here on the top and then you can you know you can also uh, resize this one depends on the size so you can make it a little bit smaller or you can make it more bigger but for the sake of this tutorial I'm just gonna make it a little bit bigger for you guys to see and make sure that you have a space between the dots and the numbers okay so I'm gonna put this one here and then the, just copy and paste for the second number what you're gonna do is just to drag here for number two and then you know uh, just change the number and then just copy paste copy paste copy paste copy paste until you uh, finished putting the numbers for all of this okay so just copy paste and then uh, put the numbers where you want to put since I started there here on top so I'm going down for the number of my 
that's okay so keep doing this and then make sure that you put the numbers maybe outside because or me you can also put inside so it won't you know hit each other so it's not you know make very difficult for especially for kids to put the numbers so if you're making thousands of dots uh, make sure uh, you put the dots and the numbers where they can uh, you know get together and not hitting each other okay so keep doing this and then once you finish this one once you put all the numbers for your project what you're gonna do is to go back to the transparency and as you see this is this is for the dots that we just uh, for the numbers that we made okay so no, we're not gonna use that what we're gonna use is this one for our picture then what you're gonna do is you can just go back to this and remove the uh, image okay so I'm going to remove the image as you see when I slide this to here to zero the image is gone so what they can only see here is the dots the teammate and the numbers so once they connect all of this after that and then what they're gonna see is the image you made it you put into your project okay so that's how you're gonna do here in Canva so keep uh, creating uh, dots and numbering so number maybe after you finish the dots okay and then so that you can think about where to start things like that so you don't you don't need to go back from the beginning again to change the numbers and to change the place where you want to so that's how you can create that to that using canva thousands of dots hundreds of dots so it depends on how many dots you want to use to your project someone who asking me is it possible to make thousands of dots so yes it is possible you can do that as many dots as you can using canva thank you so much guys for watching and i hope this helps you to create your project your activity books for kids and for you know project for adults using that to that trace things like that coloring things like that and after that they can still color the image that you put into your project hope this helped and don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell so that you get notified every time i upload the video and please share this video also to your friends so that they can learn how to do that to that using their own pictures and thank you so much for watching and see you next time bye for now